Um, all right, another PSA. This PSA is, I, I wanted to include this. We added this at the last minute. And the reason I wanted to include this PSA is because it shines a light on how important the Edge TX project is. Um, one of the reasons that Edge TX is so useful is that they are fast to respond to problems in a way that OpenTX has not been. And the problem that someone ran into this week was that the FreeSky XJT module, the micro X, uh, the, the light style XJT module, has a weird interface that means it doesn't work with some radios, uh, and specifically the Radio Master Zorro. And someone out there on the internet was trying to use it with the Radio Master Zorro, and it wasn't working. And the Edge TX project, one of the Edge TX devs, just Im like immediately were like, oh, I figured it out. Yeah, we can fix that. And boom, they just dropped a custom build of the code. It's going to be in Edge TX 2.7, which is not out yet. But this person was immediately able to have their problem solved. And it's just fantastic to see a project moving fast like that. So yeah, technically... Currently yeah, go ahead. I was just going to say, currently two people have had success uh, using an XJT Lite with a Zorro with this, uh, with this build. So if you have an XJT Lite in a Zorro and you want to make it work, it would be helpful if you go test this. Um, and if you need help with that, you can go check uh, in the Edge TX Discord and they could help you with that as well. Um, but yeah, that would be great for you to test it. Um, but yeah, they are working to, uh, to merge that into the next Edge TX. So that's yeah. great. Technically, this is a PSA because if you wanted to use an XJT module on a Zorro and you couldn't, then this would make it possible. But mostly, I just wanted yeah. to include it to say, Edge TX, kick ass, keep it up. You're awesome. 